welcome back to a, another vlog. If you are new here, hi, I am Sean. This is my channel, The Guiding Family. Over here, we post everyday vlogs, weekly vlogs, family vlogs. I'm on a weight loss journey, so you'll also see some of that. I'm so glad you are here. Make sure you stick around and subscribe if you like that type of content. Y'all, today is Saturday, July the 22nd, and I am up and I'm ready. I'm dressed because we are getting ready to run some errands. I have a Target pickup. I have an Ulta pickup. We need to stop by Lowe's and get some paint brushes and also some paint to patch some things up on the walls, y'all. I got the bright idea that I want to paint my coffee table. So if you are here from my cleaning channel, you already know I had this beautiful coffee table, but it was just too big and it didn't fit the space with the sofas and everything. So I sold that one and got a new one from Target. It's like a round table. It's pretty cheap. It came damaged. So they basically gave me the table for free. And I just don't love the color. It kind of is like orangey brown and I don't like that. I like like natural wood. So anyway, today I decided that we're going to paint it. So I'll show y'all that later on when we get to it. But I'm excited to see how it turns out. If I don't like it, I mean, it's essentially a free table. So I'm not too worried about it. But anyway, y'all, I'm going to get off of here. Get the day started. We've got to head out. Um, it's 10 o'clock in the morning. I love to run errands at this time of day when there's just a little less people out. But I'll check in with y'all a little bit later. Hey y'all, so we are back from running our quick little errands or whatever. I'm gonna show y'all what I got real, real quick from Target and Ulta and from Lowe's. It's like paint and paintbrush and stuff. I won't show y'all right now, but anyways, I got these thinly dipped dark chocolate almonds. They're dusted with cocoa powder. And I thought these would be a nice little snack. I really like chocolate covered almonds. So this is like the healthy version, if you wanna say that. So you get 24 pieces for 180 calories and I thought that was really good. Got some goldfish here, turkey bacon. That other brand I got, I do not like. So let's hope I like this because the turkey bacon I really like is from Walmart and I've seen it nowhere else, but hopefully I like this one. Chocolate pudding for the kids, strawberry cheesecake, Greek yogurt, Shabani flips, this is the s'mores. I needed some more toilet paper. This is the kind I always get, I love it. It was $7.99 on sale. And then y'all know I showed y'all I tried Poppy and we really did like them. So I got another four pack of strawberry and lemon. Well, I got a four pack because last time I only bought two and I'm like, mm, we need more. <laughs> And everybody said that the raspberry rose is really good. So decided to try that too. We gonna see, we gonna see. Um, and then from Ulta, I needed some more of this uh, Hydrate and Gentle Cleanser, the La Roche-Posay one. This is the one that I use every day. Now this bottle looks different from the one I had, but I'm pretty sure it's the same cleaner. I also got some of the uh, Double Face Repair Moisturizer. This one comes with the SPF in it, it's SPF 30. And it's just like this, y'all. I love this stuff. I like to use this during the day in the morning because it does have sunscreen in it. And then I'm trying this Good Molecules, this coloration correcting serum here. I've seen, y'all, your girl joined TikTok. That's news because I haven't had TikTok. I got TikTok last week and I saw a lot of girls say this really helped with their hyperpigmentation and dark spots. So I'm gonna try this. Let me know if you've already tried it, but I'm excited to give this a try. So this is it here. Super excited. Um, I'll let y'all know. It says improves the appearance of hyperpigmentation and dark spots. And that's what I need. I do have like dark spots and some hyperpigmentation. So I really hope this works. I'm excited. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much the haul, y'all. It is now 11.53, um, I did not work out this morning because I knew we had stuff to do. So I'm gonna go ahead and walk for about 45 minutes. And then by the time I'm done walking, it'll be time for me to break my fast and eat or whatever. But I just want to share that quick little haul with y'all. I'll see y'all later. All right, y'all, so a couple of days ago, I told y'all that I was going to paint the table well by me, I mean my husband. But this is the coffee table before. I just wanted to remind y'all what it looks like because the next time y'all see it, it will not be like this it will not be this color but yeah so here's it before and it came with this damage on it so don't mind that but yeah i think it's gonna look so much nicer all right i'll show y'all when it's done what's up y'all happy sunday it's july 30th y'all and i wasn't even gonna show myself today on the vlog because y'all i look so freaking raggedy 
okay but i don't care <laughs> y'all know i like to come out here and just be me um it's been such a great weekend like it's just been so chill and relaxing but i'm gonna have to give y'all like a little sneak peek of the table and how it's looking y'all what i didn't tell y'all is like i rearranged the living room again <laughs> i don't know how many times i do this but i've rearranged it again my husband is putting the second coat on the table um i didn't want to like show y'all the whole process because we painted so much furniture and if you're not new here then you've seen that um and we are still using the same tricorn black that we've used on all the other furniture just so everything go together but i'm gonna show y'all how it's looking all right y'all so this is how it's looking so far baby's put it on that second coat it looks beautiful wow it's looking so good you're doing a great job babe thank you i'm so impressed with your painting skills <laughs> i try i try this thing is up against that leg. I don't know if that matters, but. Yay, it's looking so good. I love it, y'all. I really do. I just feel like this is gonna make me actually like the table and be able to tolerate it until I can get me a new table. I'm really liking it. So that's how it looks. And the next time y'all see it, it'll be in the living room. Hey y'all, what's up? It's August 1st, y'all. It's a new month. Happy new month to all of us, y'all. We are gonna crush our goals this month okay we're going to do what's necessary and what needs to be done to be successful for whatever goals that we have y'all this year is flying by you hear me flying on by y'all i ain't picked up the camera i be trying to get the glare out my glasses but whatever i haven't picked up the camera in so long um i think i did pick it up for just briefly maybe yesterday to show y'all how the table was turning out or the day before, I don't remember. Y'all, my days, they just run together. I just got up. We had like nap and quiet time. I was resting. I did not go to sleep or anything, but I did rest, which was much needed. I'm about to get ready to prep a homeschool lesson for the kids. But um, before I do that, I am gonna have me some greens um but i wanted to show y'all so one of my friends she has like a um blinging business y'all she's so talented in so many different ways but she made me a cup she blinged me a cup and i just gotta share y'all this is my cup y'all look how pretty because she already know i be getting my water in so this is adorable i do have a straw I don't know why there's not a straw in there. Hold on. So it came with the straw, um, but y'all, I'm a little extra and bought some straws on Amazon. So I did get these straws here. Um, I'll just show y'all what it looks like with a straw. So just lift the top off. There's a straw that I got. And these straws were cheap. They were like $6 for a set of, I don't even know how many, but yeah, look adorable with the pink straw y'all can't tell me i'm not gonna be drinking in style and yes the straws are washed and everything and also y'all she blinged me out a pen can y'all see that ah, i love it so it has flowers it's so cute love 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 it her instagram is at luxury blings and like i said this is my good good friend so i will link her instagram in the description box in case you want to check out some of her stuff but yeah y'all it's so cute thank you friend i absolutely love it y'all been so lazy i was lazy towards the end of july because you know what i had such a crappy last week of the month maybe last two ish weeks like just crappy for no reason like why aren't you being good to me so i just i just took a back seat sometimes you got to take a back seat and just you know let god lead okay we be trying to be leaders when you know we need to be following him and y'all i was getting in my head about things and like self-doubt anyways i'm feeling better i'm feeling more like me and so we're gonna have a great week. I don't have a whole lot planned or anything because y'all like, it's August. Everybody is like either preparing for back to school or have already started. I saw today on Instagram, so many kids went back to school already. And I think here they go back to school next Monday. So with that being said, 
I'm in the throes of planning for the new homeschool year. Y'all, my lips are so dry. I'm planning uh, for the new homeschool year. We're still waiting on a couple things to come in curriculum wise. Um, we downloaded and printed so many of them because we use the good and the beautiful and you can get the core subjects for free. You just need to print them and maybe bind them by yourself. So we did that. And then all the others um, we purchased and we're waiting on those. So I'm just ready to get everything planned. I'm praying for a great successful school year for everybody all the kids that have gone back to school my kids who are getting ready to go into a new year so yeah i'm getting ready to do that in just a minute y'all <laughs> after i have my greens and i really don't i've been struggling to chug this water down that's another thing just don't know i literally just finished chugging like my 50 ounce cup yeah, my stomach is just feeling like water is just sloshing around. So, yeah, I really don't want to drink this, but I'm going to do it anyway. Y'all, let me show y'all. So, we always write the day of the week on the board, but today is Tuesday. Let me show y'all real quick. So, today is Tuesday, and we always do Taco Tuesday. And my husband made this for the kids. It's so cute. He wrote this and everything, y'all. His handwriting be rivaling with mine because... Mine is bomb too, but my husband has really good handwriting. However, like he drew these cute little tacos and he made this one for Sydney with the heart because she requested it. But I thought that was just so cute. But anyway, y'all, I've been making some changes. Like I've been saying, oh, I can't buy anything, y'all. I broke down and bought like some new artwork for the living room. I'm waiting on it to come in. Let me get y'all together. So I bought some new artwork. I'm just waiting on it to come in because we painted the table and it's done it's done drying my husband's gonna bring it inside today i cannot wait to show y'all i just wanted it to be out there extra day because my rug is real light so we don't want to get no black paint on it i want to be make sure everything was like dry 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 so that's done i'm so excited and we rearranged the living room i don't think i mentioned that but yeah we changed it around again because i have issues and i just like stuff to be different all the time like that's just me. So anyway, we rearranged the living room and I'm loving the flow of it. I feel like we have a lot more floor space and the openness. I really do like it a lot. So I'm gonna show y'all, but not right now. I'll show y'all whenever he brings the table in. But yeah, I'm super happy with it. It's just some small changes. Sometimes you just need something. Like I needed something to calm down my need to, to buy stuff, <laughs> to like buy new stuff, which I did buy stuff but for the most part like i saved a lot of money by painting my table now don't don't hold me to this table if i decide to get something else but for now it's gonna work but anyway i'm gonna see y'all in a minute all right y'all so the table is now in my living room y'all ready to see it all right three two one here's my table oh my gosh it looks so good like so much better like, I can't even, I can't even. I love it. It just made me like it a lot more. And once I get some artwork here, so I did rearrange the living room, I may as well show y'all. I haven't cleaned up today, so like, don't judge. But like, this is how the living room is looking. And I was worried about like blocking that fireplace, but truth be told, we don't use a fireplace, y'all. It's hot all the time. So yeah, the TV is over here now when you walk in. So like, here's my entryway and you're walking into the living room and all this like extra floor space has been so nice. Um, I put my little ottoman there, extra blankets and stuff. And yeah, this is how it looks. I'm gonna switch out my pillow covers. I already have some that'll like, you know, look really good. I bought some pictures to go here. It's three pictures. One, two, three. They'll go right there. So, yeah, this is looking so good. Let me know what you guys think about the table. And just over here is like my little workout zone. So, like my weights, my treadmill. I keep my shoes there because I work out every day. And here's the fireplace that we don't use. This is like my foot massager. And I'm using this to like house like extra socks, my sweat belt my um my gloves when i'm working out obviously random stuff that my kids throw in there and then our air purifier is there so yeah let me know what you guys think 
about the table like it's really giving i'm gonna put this um hey blake <laughs> i'm gonna put this tree in a whole different planter i've been looking i'm gonna look when we go out probably over the weekend and see if i can find something i like just that i'll like a lot better i mean it's fine gray because my couch is gray but i just want something different but yeah you guys will have to let me know what you think about the rearrangement of the furniture and also how the table turned out. My husband is literally like a painting expert at this point. Hey y'all, what's up? Happy Wednesday, it's August 2nd, y'all. It's like three something in the afternoon and I'm just now picking up the camera and <laughs> saying hey, saying what's up. But I've had a really, really good day. Productive, worked out, um, read, like spent some time reading cause I really want to like, read more like i'm a bookie but sometimes like my life is just too busy and i feel like i don't have as much time to read so i spent some time reading um spending time with the kids stuff like that right now they're doing like some independent work and then we're gonna do a lesson but i got an order from beacon threads now i've talked about them a lot this is not sponsored okay however i get a lot of my like christian apparel from them like t-shirts and stuff and so i just wanted to share what i got y'all um it's just coming in so it's kind of like my first time seeing it as well so this shirt says pray more worry less i love this pretty blue color i don't have anything in this color let me see if i can show y'all so like yeah my trash can is back there real classy but this is the shirt and yes, it's oversized, y'all. I should have sized down, but I'm okay with that. It'll be like a really nice, like, biker short shirt. So, that's this one. I also got this one. I thought this was cute. So, right here by the neckline, it says Victorious. Y'all, I feel like this one's bigger than the other one, and I don't know why. They're all unisex. And then, it just says First Corinthians 15 and 57. But thanks be to God. He gives us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ on this one. And then this one doesn't have anything. So I thought that was cute. It's like a little touch of something instead of just being a plain t-shirt. But it's not like doing too much. And I really do like this color. This would be a really pretty fall color. So I decided to get like different colors because typically when I'm ordering from Beacon Threads, I get all the black shirts. Every black shirt they got, get in black, 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 black. <laughs> So I'm trying to make myself wear a little more color. Um, so the last shirt that I got, which is so cute. And this one just says the joy of the Lord is my strength. With a smiley face, a pink little smiley face. It is so cute. Oh, I love this. And like I said, I don't have anything in these colors. So I really like it. I am very much a t-shirt girl. I love my t-shirts. I love my leggings. I love jeans. I love it all, but a t-shirt is just my vibe. And also, y'all, I was on the website and I was like, I don't need it. I don't need it. <laughs> but I got it anyway, so let me show y'all what I got. Y'all, look at my mug. Look at my mug in the back. It says, goodness and mercy. It's Psalms 23 and 6. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. And I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Amen. Okay. And this is my cute little mug that I'm going to be drinking my coffee in, my teas in. I don't know. I'm just a sucker for a mug. And this one has meaning, okay? Something to keep you grounded, you know, while you're sipping your little coffee or whatever you're going to have. And I'm actually going to have coffee now, but I probably won't use this because I got to give it a good wash. But it's really heavy. It feels really good. Um. So, yeah, that's my little beacon threads haul so if you haven't checked them out and you like any of these i will link their shop so you can go and support them like i said i'm not getting paid to promote this or tell y'all about it but i really do like the quality of their shirts they really hold up in the wash i've had some for years and they do really well i have so many of them now so yeah i'm happy with those another thing y'all that i got um i got this see you gotta put it together you know how you be buying stuff and you don't realize you got to put it together? It's not like a lot to put together, but regardless, it has to be put together. But it's like this, uh, you can hang your keys here. So 
this piece will get screwed on right here. And then you have these little hooks here. Actually, this is upside down. So it'll go like this. And then you put the hooks in here and you can hang your keys and stuff on there. And we really don't have like a drop zone here. And I'm thinking I might put it right here behind me. This is our laundry room that goes out into the garage. I'm thinking I might put it there just to have somewhere designated for keys to go. You can drop mail here if you want to. Now it's not a big space, which I didn't want because I don't want to look clutter, okay? I don't like clutter. So anyway, this has to get put together. But when we hang it up, I'll show y'all how it looks. Um, but I thought it was really cute, really minimal. This is from Amazon and it was very affordable like 11 or 12 dollars so that's really cheap um but yeah y'all that's it that's all i've been doing i'm waiting on one more package from fedex because remember yesterday i was on here and i told y'all that i ordered some pictures to go on the wall they weren't expensive or anything like that i just kind of wanted something in the space now to have the living room changed around and the table painted so Whenever it gets here, I'll come back and show y'all how that looks. But for now, I had to go, y'all. I got to get some dinner prepped. I got to get some schoolwork done with my kids. And I'll see y'all in a little while. What's up, y'all? So, I am back. Y'all, I literally just got done cooking dinner. Um, we haven't eaten yet. But look, y'all. Ah, y'all see that box? That's what I've been waiting on. So, we got to open it and get a look at this artwork I got. I hope I like it. If not, I'll send it back and get something else because it was very, very affordable. Okay, let's open it. Yeah, I'm over here convincing my husband that I need a new phone, but I really don't need a new phone because I'm not an upgrade your phone all the time person. But I think I had this phone since 2020, right? It's 2023, but you know what? It's paid off. It ain't no extra bill. I hope y'all can see me. It's a little dark over here. your girl not already hung them up okay but if i don't like it i'm taking it right back down but those are so cute so we probably gonna hang those up what after dinner yeah i'm excited can y'all tell like what i'm the vibe i'm going with since i'm real rich living i'm thinking about right here where this ottoman is putting like a floor lamp that kind of you know maybe cascades right here so i think if i put something here that takes up some space it'll be okay to have wall art I'm gonna go shopping this weekend. We're gonna see what we can find. I'm not, I'm gonna look for a lamp online, but I am looking for a new planter for my olive tree. I don't know, I got the decorate bug. And it is coming up on, what, fall in a couple months. And I like to make everything like warm and cozy during fall season, but really liking the way the table is looking. I changed my pillow covers. 
And the artwork really works with the vibe of the living room. And these pictures, three of them for like $130. Can I make this up? I'm going to drop the link in the description box. But yeah, I'm going to come back later when we get ready to hang them up. Bye. All right, y'all. It's umpteen hours later. And I just remembered that we need to hang this up. So earlier, I kind of marked where I wanted it. And of course, leveled it out. But we command stripping it because that's what you do. That's what you do. Let me help you out, baby. Huh? Oh, yeah, that's gonna do us good. Okay, hang some peas right here. I don't really think you're gonna hang too many letters up there, but that ain't really what I got it for. I really got it for the keys because if we need it somewhere else to put stuff. All good. All right, y'all. So, this is what it looks like super cute. Super basic, it ain't taking up no space. Like I said, it's right by the garage, right in the laundry area. By this ugly contraption here. But yeah, I was gonna put some art right here, but mm, we need to be functional. So yep, there it is. All right, y'all, so now that that is done, I told y'all we was gonna hang up them pictures, but not realizing I need to order some more command strips, y'all. And you might be saying, you gonna hang them heavy pictures with command strips? Yes, I hang all of them with it, but you just gotta put the right weight of command strips so anyway i didn't have enough so i had to order some and they said they'll be here friday it's currently wednesday so we'll see i'll have to check back in whenever that happens but yeah it's eight o'clock so i gotta put my children to bed and um get myself in the bed and relax so i'll see y'all in the morning hey y'all what's up good morning it's saturday august 5th it is like 9 30 in the morning and i'm dressed and ready to go i got on one of these shirts that i showed y'all last time so i have this t-shirt on and i just have on some um cargos or whatever real casual but getting ready to go um y'all know i like to run my errands early so when i'm up on the weekend it's to run some early errands getting ready to go i want to go to hobby lobby i don't even know what i'm looking for in there because i don't really shop in there but i might get some fall florals because i think that's the only thing i was gonna go all out but now that y'all have seen that i'm working on the living room i think what i have fall decor obviously already so i think i'm just gonna throw out some warm fall tones so i'm gonna look for maybe some fall florals and some craft stuff for the kids because we do homeschool so that's pretty much what i'm gonna get out of there i really want to go buy home goods but i don't know we'll see because they don't open until like 11 or 12 i don't understand these stores opening so late like people be up and ready to shop yeah and then maybe bath and body works because i want some lotion but i'm gonna see if it's on sale because last time i went they had no sale and I'm not buying no full price. But I really do need some. So we'll see what the day brings. I got the command hooks to hang up those pictures that I was showing y'all. So we're going to hang them up today for sure. So I'm super excited about that. I can't wait to see how I like them and if I like them. If it's the vibe that I'm really going for. Uh, I don't know. The switch up just makes me so super happy y'all. But yeah. Get ready to head out. So I'll check y'all out a little bit later. Made it y'all. Interesting. And this is giving way too much for me. be cute on a coffee table but it might be a little too orange for me so I'm thinking about this for the homeschool room it's so nice it's definitely like the color vibe I like it's eighty dollars, but I like it. I don't know. I'm gonna think about this. Now this is adorable. It's fifty dollars. Why are they not sale? Oh, y'all! I was like really about to buy this. 
but mm, they really need to mark it down. So cute. So Blake has a gamer like room theme, and I think we're gonna get this here. We're trying to find something to go with it. I don't know. I like the neon sign. I don't like the price. This one is kind of cute. His room has like a lot of blacks. That's not bad. Hmm. Just five more minutes. That sound about right, don't it? Which one you like that? I really like that one a lot. I might have to bite the bullet. I feel like the green is like a very popular oops color this year. This one's $12.99. Maybe I'll get this one to add to the other one. That's cute. I'm really striking out with florals y'all like I'm not really seeing what I'm really looking for. Hmm. Stuff like this give me anxiety. Like, how I know what's in these flowers? Like, this is, this is cute. $15.99. Baby, they way too proud of that. Mm -mm. Target don't even want that much. Mm -mm, baby, they ain't on sale this week. Back from shopping. Y'all, I am like sweating. I'm about to get out of these clothes because it feels like 104 outside. Like, it's hot. And I feel like I look as hot as I feel, but we ended up outside of Hobby Lobby. I showed y'all a little today. We went to um, Home Goods. They didn't really have a whole lot, but I got a few things I'll show y'all. And then five below. So I'm gonna give y'all a quick little haul, show y'all what I got while we were out. All right, so we'll start with Hobby Lobby. I did find this cute little cream pumpkin with the burlap right here. Thought this was real cute and neutral. It was $12.99, but all the fall things were 40% off, so. Got that. Also got this cute little smiley face pillow my daughter picked out. I don't know how much it was. It said $17.99, but it was on sale for who knows how much. Um, I got this little gamer wall decor for my son. This is so cute. I literally cannot wait to hang this up in his room. And then Sydney picked out this little wall decor. Unicorns make me happy because unicorns are her thing. If you don't know, this is kind of her room theme. And it was on sale for $5.99. My girl know how to pick up a sale, okay? Also, y'all, what I really went in there for was some crafts for the kids. So I found this like Minecraft paint your own figurine little craft set. And it was $7.99. Thought that was a good deal. There's two of them in here. It comes with the paint and the paintbrush. Also got Sydney, this frozen plaster paint activity kit. And they all come with the paint, which is so nice. And it was only $6.99. And then I could not pass these up. These were uh, paint your own scented unicorns. So like unicorn ice cream cones. Look how cute that is. $2.49, y'all. $2.49. So I got this one and this one. So I thought these were adorable. So yeah. Just a few little crafts here. And then from Home Goods, I told y'all I didn't get that much. I only got three little things here. Let me show y'all. So I got this pumpkin. It got some nice weight to it. This was $9.99. Super cute. I don't know. I'm into neutrals, y'all know. So I decorate pretty neutral and fall with a little bit of um like rust, I think I'm going to do. Because that's what I did last year. But I thought this was so cute. Like I said, it's a nice weight to it. This will look really cute. I also got this vanilla cinnamon candle. Got an acorn on it. I just thought this was adorable for a file. And the bonus is it actually smells good, but that's not exactly why I bought it. This was $14.99, but it's a big... Ooh, see, I'm going to break it. This is a big old candle, y'all. Child, let me put it down before I break it. So cute. And then I got this chocolate chip cookie DW Home candle. It smells pretty good. It does smell like a chocolate chip cookie. 
and it was $7.99 so yeah that's what I got out of home goods I didn't film in there y'all because it was like wall to wall packed up in there I don't know what's going on but everybody and their grandma was in there okay five below my husband got these wireless controllers for the kids switches so that they can do like two players and he just got two sets of those they were ten dollars and then he got them both a pair of headphones for school here because they do listen to like um stories and read-alongs and stuff like that so that's super cute and these were both five like 550 each so yeah it was a good deal but yeah y'all that's pretty much what we got from the store it is just about 12 o'clock so my kids want lunch so i'm about to prep some lunch for them get all this stuff put away put in their rooms they're gonna be super excited but i'm definitely gonna come back today because i want to show y'all the pictures when we finally get them hung up but we have to get out of these outside clothes get some in the house clothes on and chill so i'll see y'all a little bit later hey what's up y'all so it is hours later it's like three something in the afternoon and i just got some stuff from costco you can kind of see it right here i don't know y'all i just felt like getting stuff in bulk like i order sporadically in bulk but the amount of money we be spending on these groceries like maybe try to save in some way we ain't save nothing today but it should help us save you know on future orders so i don't have to keep buying the same things like snacks and stuff that my kids are always eating put on my lotion so y'all cannot be talking about me okay let me show you let me show you what i get sorry about the lighting y'all it's a little trash i got some crispy Take our wings, the sweet chipotle barbecue ones. Organic super smoothie blend. So excited. I think it comes with, yep, six packs. They're eight ounce bags. Each pouch is 100 calories. So this would be a nice little like snack or refresher drink. Tilapia loins here. Also got these super fruit organic freezy pops. Thought these were so cute for us and the kids one bar is only 25 calories these definitely got a freeze i can tell they didn't completely you know <laughs> defrosted because it's 100 degrees outside today kind bars it's 20 bars in here i got salty caramel dark chocolate almond and then dark chocolate almond and sea salt i love almonds i love dark chocolate so these are like a really good snack really good source of protein also got some chips just the variety pack. It's 54 bags of chips in here. The skinny pop. I actually ordered a boom chicka pop, but got skinny pop. Gogurt. This is strawberry and mixed berry. Got some applesauce pouches for the kids. Black Forest organic gummy bears. This one for me. Red grapefruit cups. Only me and Sydney eat these. So yeah, these are the red grapefruit cups. So good, y'all. So good. And then I got a variety pack of cookies, crackers stuff like that i also got sparkling water regular water i'll show you hold on so this is the sparkling water i got it's just the kirkland signature the costco brand zero calories zero sugar sparkling waters and then over here i have bath tissue boom i have paper towels i got some Lysol wipes here, and then two cases of water. And also, clearly, some curriculums just came in, some Amazon stuff, and I'll show y'all a little later. All right, y'all, and now I have a Kroger grocery haul. Don't judge me, y'all, it's like grocery day, okay? I bulk shopped for some stuff, but then I had to get like some things that we needed for like the week or the next couple of weeks or however long. So yeah, I guess I'll share that with y'all. Y'all don't judge me. For these oversized shirts okay i don't even know what to say it is what it is but yeah i'm gonna show y'all a quick haul i'm trying to figure out if i feel like being lazy all right y'all so this is everything we got from kroger minus the stuff that we're still putting up from costco yes yeah, a lot going on um let's start here i got gatorade zero pouches i'm really liking these for just extra electrolytes five calories and then i also saw these gatorade zero packs with protein so i'm like okay 10 grams of protein for 45 calories not bad got that then i got this one for my hubby just a regular gatorade where he can make his own pop tarts cookies and cream mission street tacos mission zero tortillas sweet peas broccoli carrots cauliflower and cheese and like a light cheese sauce y'all these are so good 
Calories are low. Chopped green peppers. I'm gonna make steak tacos. And I like I like bell peppers in my tacos. In my steak. I don't know about y'all. Cream of chicken soup. I'm gonna be uh, baking some chicken with this. Caramel macchiato, zero sugar coffee creamer. Apple juice back there for the kids. Sara Lee, delightful. 45 calorie multigrain bread. Can't wait to try this. Got some Yo Crunch yogurt with toppings. This is the M&M and Oreo. My kids love these, so. Got those, some hash brown patties, chicken fries, sweet potato fries. Also got some Greek yogurt, y'all know. I love my yogurt, so I got the strawberry banana chobani ones. These are 130 calories for like 11 grams of protein. And then I also got chobani flips, strawberry cheesecake, and s'more s'mores. Those are my faves. Taco shells for taco night. Some mozzarella cheese, Hobie Jack, sugar-free syrup. Y'all, this syrup literally has 10 calories for two tablespoons and two tablespoons is like a lot more than you think and then i got all these lunchables here for my kiddos turkey and ham beef shaved steak chicken breast tenders and then some lean ground beef this is 96 4. it's just a leaner uh beef and it's way lower calories than others it's like 140 calories for whoops about four ounces i got these two snack packs which y'all I'm so mad because obviously we just got some from Costco, but the only reason I added these on my Kroger order is because the lady said that they were out of stock. So now I have these and honestly, I might end up giving them to my sister, but I just realized my daughter likes these chocolate ones. So I might have to take them out for her. We'll see. Chips, Funyuns. I also got myself some baked chips for like, you know, just to switch up my snacks. So I have some baked chips and it comes with the white cheddar popcorn. Capri Suns, these are the Roaring Water ones. They're just like a flavor water. That's, that's what they are. <laughs> these are just original Pringles. And over here, non-food items, Lysol laundry sanitizer. Got some bleach. It's bleached the same better days. And then this is the disinfectant bleach, by the way some trash bags the clorox ones these are 30 gallon because that's what fits our trash can i also got some toothpaste and y'all i was influenced to try this so i got this thera breath uh oral rinse can't wait to try this um yeah i'm super excited to add this to like my routine but yeah y'all this is the haul as y'all can see there is quite a bit of stuff to put away, so I'm about to tackle that, and then I'll see y'all in a little while. Hey, y'all. What's up? Happy Sunday. It's August the 6th, y'all. I look a little bit crazy. It's just a day in the house. It's actually my laundry day, so y'all, you girl been doing laundry. I think currently I've done like four loads, but I've only folded two so far, so I got to get it rotating here in a minute. But before I cook dinner, I decided like, let's go ahead and hang these pictures on the wall. I showed y'all the artwork that I got from Amazon. Um, and I'll show y'all again once it's on the wall. Earlier today, my husband went ahead and like marked it to like hang up. So just to make the process go quicker. Like I said, we do hang with command strips. I know I've been seeing a lot of people say like they don't use command strips because they pictures fall off the wall. Y'all ours don't do that. Like, let me show you. Y'all see this picture is from Amazon and it's heavier than these or about the same weight and it's been on the wall for over a year <laughs> like and it has command strips so yeah we just put the right weight like these pictures i looked online they're about 16 and a half pounds so the command strips i have hold 16 pounds we'll just double it up and use two set you know it's like four in total but like you stick two together and put them on the wall so yeah y'all i'm excited to see how this is going to look finally have something on my walls y'all my wall's been empty for over a year since we've been here and it's just crazy um i hope i like them i like them just looking at them now i will say they look textured so if you go and buy these let me just let y'all know now they are not textured it has a textured appearance but you can't feel any texture so that's just the thing about getting a print that's kind of cheap you save me a little money but you want something on your walls that's kind of what i'm the the season i'm in right now um so yeah there's that I really do like them and I can't wait to sit on the wall. Okay, so it's time to hang them up. Y'all ready? Yay! One, two, one, go. I can't tell if it's up or not. Can y'all tell? Can't nobody tell. Ain't nobody about to come in here with a ruler and be like, oh my God, your picture's not perfectly symmetrical. Like, bye. Let's get to me. Come on. 
god, I'm freaking roasting. It's hot. What do y'all think? It's already like looking so good. My husband's so technical. He's like, I think this one's a little higher. And I'm like, ain't nobody gonna know. Okay. And if they do know, we don't care. Hi, pretty. Look at your pretty pillow, mama. Oh. Oh. <sighs> Sorry, I'm just sitting all in the way, child. Like my head ain't deep. Yay, we're done. Oh my God. Why am I the one sweating and you did all the work? I'm only sweating because it's really hot. It's like 100 degrees. All right, y'all, so my couch is in shambles, but look how good this looks. I mean, they look absolutely gorgeous up there. Definitely matching the vibe. Like, do y'all see what I'm doing here? I did not find a planter this weekend. We're going we're gonna to keep looking, y'all. We're going to keep looking. If y'all know of a good planter, send me a link. Planter. I'm a little country. However, <laughs> I'm looking for a planter for this olive tree. So if you see one, you think about me, let me know where you saw it at or send me a link or whatever. But these are the pictures. I'm gonna come close so y'all can see. So here is the picture. You see what I mean by it has that texture look, but there's no real texture. Don't you just love that? Like you get the look for less. These look gorgeous. I'm really pleased with how they just gave a little life to the living room. My husband tried to fix the pillows. Bless his heart. They look good enough. I think this one is backwards though. But um, yeah, just ignore that. I'm gonna get it all the way together. But yay, this looks so good. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. All right, y'all, I'm about to make dinner, so I figured I would chit chat with y'all while I do so. Just making some like steak tacos, if you will. Um, I don't have any lettuce, and I guess all the stuff I bought yesterday, I forgot to get lettuce. But the last couple times I got lettuce, it was, it had gone bad before I could even use it. I'm breaking up some of these uh, chopped bell peppers. Um, I could buy fresh bell peppers, but we honestly just freeze them anyway. So this is convenient. I'm actually gonna measure them. Yep, I measure everything. I'm gonna measure my bell peppers real quick. It's kind of gonna be like, like we make our, uh, what's it called? Philly steak sandwiches, but in a tortilla. I'm gonna use a little bit of peppers, not too much. It ain't that much meat, so that's enough. I'm just gonna be using some steak seasoning. Um, I don't know the brand, I just put it in here. So steak seasoning, bell peppers, and some beef shaved steak. I'm gonna get this cooking. Cause it is 442, honey. What time do y'all typically uh, cook and eat dinner? I know a lot of people work, so you can't like realistically eat early. Um, I don't eat after six, well, I'll say seven, because sometimes at six, you know, I have a snack, which is usually a yogurt. And then I'll be done for the day. So for the most part, I fast between one and six. Yeah, so this steak, it comes in like thin strips, but I'll be having to like chop them up as I cook it. Cause I kind of want it to be like, like ground steak meat. It's ground as you can get it. So yeah, I'm about to do that real quick. These are the tortillas that I use. I'm gonna use four of these. Four of these are 100 calories, they're 25 calories a piece. And then, of course, I had to make my husband's food. And these are the ones he used. And his are 150 calories for two, which still isn't bad, it's about 75 calories a piece. Some mozzarella cheese. Here's my, this is about uh, four ounces of the steak. But I go ahead and like put them together and then I heat them on the stove. Girl, what is wrong with this one? Mm -mm. Yeah, all of them coming out looking a little weird. There we go. We're gonna put them back. We're not feeling weird today. Go ahead and press them. 
trying to keep as much inside as I can. So there's mine before I fry them. I'm gonna make my husband. Y'all, the kids are getting waffles and sausage because they don't eat steak. Anybody else be making their kids something different? My kids love breakfast, so it's an easy fix. We ain't tripping. Be sure not to overfill these too much or half of your food is just gonna be in the pan. Don't prove me wrong, prove you right. Don't prove me wrong, prove you right. My word is but we don't spit no lies. A daughter of the sunshine. But every blue moon. Or how mine turned out crispy cheesy yummy cannot wait to eat these you can dip them some sour cream or whatever you want but yep this is my plate and now i have to make my husband's plate real quick so that's what i'm about to do It's Wednesday, August 9th, y'all. And earlier I showed y'all a little clip because I was at the doctor. I was just getting like a, I don't wanna say checkup because I, I needed an appointment because I was having some issues. So anyways, y'all, they gave you girl a shot. So I had to get a steroid shot and he prescribed me some antibiotics and also like a some allergy type of meds so basically like i've had a swollen lymph node here um uh, for about two months and y'all my hair looks crazy but i don't care <laughs> and it just was not going away and it was worrying me because i'm like mm, it's never good for your lymph nodes to be swollen but you know i have a lot of sinus issues so i'm thinking okay let me just treat the symptoms and it'll go away where well, it wasn't going away it's painful or whatever so he checked everything today and basically, because my ears always hurt and I can feel the drainage. I have a lot of fluid in my ear, basically like an ear infection, upper respiratory infection, sinus infection. So, yeah, treating all of that. Um, <laughs> but I'm okay. I'm really just happy to know what it is now so that I can start feeling better. So, yeah, y'all, um, I was editing this vlog last night and it's so long so i'm actually gonna just end it here so i can pick up and start another one thank you guys so much for just being here and watching i hope y'all enjoy hanging out with your girl today and i will see y'all in the next one bye